Hello students, uh, we are going to solve problem based on module 1 that is uh, particularly that is a cylinder problem uh, here the cylinder means uh, the steam pipe we consider cylinder geometry so first let us uh, read out the problem what it is given and what to find out a steam pipe of outer diameter 120 mm is covered with two layers of lagging inside layer 45 mm thick k is equal to 0 0.8 watt per meter degree centigrade and outside layer is 30 meter thick 30 mm thick and k varies 0 0.12 watt per meter degree centigrade the pipe conveys steam at a pressure of 20 bar with 50 degrees celsius superheat the outside temperature of lagging is 25 degree centigrade if the steam pipe is 30 meter long determine the heat loss per hour Second one is interface temperature of lagging and the thermal resistance of the steam pipe may be neglected. So that there are two parameters we are going to supposed to find out. Okay. So let us uh, will write uh, data which is given the problem. So they have given directly R and other problem diameter. So K only they have given. So first we will draw that to sketch. This is assumed as the steam pipe front view. Okay. Okay. This is the steam pipe. Uh, this is having a and one more insulation will be there insulation will be there over that insulation one more insulation will be there Okay, this insulation Okay So, this is steam. Steam pipe. Insulation. The steam pipe and this is insulation. Insulation. Insulation A we can say. And insulation B. This was insulation B. And the radius of that okay, this is R1, R2, and this is R3. Okay, so this thickness is uh, 45 mm, and this thickness is. 30 mm okay so r1 diameter is given we have to take divided by 2 for the diameter we'll get mm uh, for the radius we have to convert into meter and r2 is 60 plus 45 plus thickness we have to add 105 mm 0 0.105 meter and R3 that is 105 plus 30 that is 135 mm is equals to 0 0.135 meter and Ka is equals to 0 0.08 
watt per meter degree centigrade and kb is 0.12 watt per meter degree centigrade and meanwhile t3 is given 25 degree centigrade and length of the pipe so if you consider this is the cylinder pipe steam pipe having some length okay that length is given okay this length is how much 25 degrees centigrade length is 30 meter 30 meter long okay what we have to do uh, that uh, corresponding uh, uh, 20 bar pressure from the steam pipe will get sometime in examination they will give directly the property okay so from the steam corresponding 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 to 20 bar from steam table you get T saturation temperature is saturation temperature is 214.2 degrees centigrade okay so therefore temperature of the steam T sat plus 50 so 212.4 plus 50 that is 262.4 degree centigrade okay so once you find out this value then you can calculate heat first one is heat lost per hour so the rate the rate of heat transfer transfer is given by given by Q is equals to 2 pi L T1 minus T2 ln of R2 by R1 by Ka plus ln of R3 by R2 divided by Kb now Q becomes Q value 2 pi into 30 to 62.4 minus 25 whole divided by ln of 0 0.105 divided by 0 0.06 divided by k is 0 0.08 plus ln of 0 0.135 0 0.105 divided by 0 0.12 the q becomes 4923 watts or we can say joules per second also therefore heat lost per hour 4923 into 3600 divided by 1000 and it becomes 17722.8 kilojoule per hour this is the answer for the second uh, question interface temperature of lagging interface temperature of lagging T2 that is Q is equals to 2 pi L T1 minus T2 divided by ln of R2 by R1 divided by Ka or 4923 2 pi into 30 262.4 minus T2 divided by ln of 
पॉइंट जीरो पॉइंट वन जीरो फाइव डॉट बाई जीरो पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एट देन टू सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फोर यू टेक दिस वन बिकॉज नॉन इज टी टू यू आर गोइंग टू फाइंड आउट माइनस टी टू फोर नाइन टू थ्री डॉट बाई टू पाई इंटू थर्टी इंटू लैन ऑफ जीरो पॉइंट वन जीरो फाइव जीरो पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स डिवाइड बाई जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एट सो फाइनली टी टू इज इक्वल्स टू टू सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फोर वन एटी टू पॉइंट जीरो नाइन सो सिक्स नाइन इट बिकम्स सेवेंटी नाइन पॉइंट वन नाइन डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड सो दिस इज द इंटरफेस टेम्परेचर इट इज सेवेंटी नाइन पॉइंट वन नाइन डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड So this is the desired answer. Thanks for watching this video.